Mr. Odell. Uh, I taught at least at one point all levels of English, 9, 10, 11, and 12, but mostly freshmen and sophomores throughout my teaching career. I taught for 15. I went to Ohio University for my bachelor's degree, and I went to Bowling Green for my master's degree and for my ed specialist degree. How was your experience? In college? Very good. Yeah, I, I, I uh, did my graduate degrees, obviously, while I was still teaching, so that presented its challenges and things like that, but um, I had a great college experience and, and enjoyed it very much, and um, it's a lot of work, but uh, good stuff. I decided to become a teacher when um, I was I was a student assistant for the football team at Ohio University, and um, they had a go out and read to, to kids and to talk to uh, local school students and there were a number of players that couldn't make it at that time so they sent me as a substitute in a couple of situations and I found that I kind of enjoyed that being in front of the class talking to kids talking to students decided to try uh, an education course and it felt right and here I am oh I, I, I think you know one thing, I don't know there's been a whole lot of huge changes. I think Wasian has, uh, ever since I've been here, been very, um, been very willing to, to change with, with the times, willing to change with the, 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 the new legislation in education. So a lot of what we've done, we've always done it incrementally. As things happen, we try to make those adjustments. So we've never really had a very huge swing or one big shift at the same time that you know I've heard that it's happened in other schools. Um, so most of the things have been pretty incremental. So I, I guess I could say I've never really noticed a huge change. Um, you know, it's a great place to work. We, we have a, a great faculty. We've always had a great student body. So I think that's remained pretty consistent. So I, I can't say there's been a huge change. You probably didn't know that I, I spent my entire career here at Wasian. Most students here probably didn't know that I taught English in the classroom. Most students probably didn't know that I coached football for 14 years and spent seven years as the defensive coordinator. Probably don't know that I coached middle school wrestling for nine years. Um, so a lot, probably a lot of my career to students that are here right now, that, those are probably things that they wouldn't know. They probably just think I sit there in the office and have always done that and wrote detentions for my whole career. Best part of the job? Uh, best part of the job is working with you guys. You know, I, I, I like being here. I, I like what I do. Uh, I like working with, uh, with young adults. Um, I don't know that um, working with lower um, grades, you know, will, will, will quite be where I fit in. You know, I like the interaction. I like the, the you know, the, the young adult to adult interaction. And um, I just, I know, I think I relate pretty well to you guys. I always felt that way, and I, I like what I do. I, I like the whole staff. I think we have a fantastic staff. Um, I really do, and I'm not just, I'm, I'm not making that up. It's, <clears throat> it's, it's a fact. I mean, we have, we have a lot of good, caring people that, you know, in, a, in any situation, you have people that have different opinions and things like that. But this staff always finds a way to, to find the middle ground and come together and, and, and do what we need to do to get you guys to, to where you need to be at the end of your senior year. So I work most closely with Mr. Leatherman, obviously, in my, in my current position, but, uh, you know, I, I'm, we got a fantastic staff. I, I couldn't pick a favorite. Um, I am married with two kids. Landon's in fifth grade and Sydney's in third grade. And we have a dog, a chocolate lab. His name is Eddie. And I named him after my all-time favorite musician, Eddie Vedder of the band Pearl Jam. <laughs>